Jane 3 of them are flashing their lights at you, Jane. Oh, wow. see the kids seeing the flashlights uh, back at us while we were shining our lights and our spotlights. Uh, all three of us looked at each other and we were smiling a lot. <laughs> it was awesome, yeah. So we're excited about Project Night Lights because we really believe that it's going to be powerful for our patients. It's difficult to be here in the Children's Hospital for a little bit of time or a lengthy period of time. But when they get a chance to see all the support that our community is going to give through this project and they see the lights that are flashing, wishing them good night, wishing them to continue to fight on, I think the message is going to be very powerful for them. Wait, I see them. Can you see them? Go over. See them over there in the corner? Yeah. When Silent Observer heard that other communities around the country were doing Project Night Lights, we had to bring it to Grand Rapids because we really thought it would be special for the patients at the Helen DeVos Children's Hospital. It was just something very important for us to do because we wanted to show these kids how much we love them, how much we care for them, how much we stand by them as they fight the battle of their lives. When they did find us, they would flash they would flash their lights and then we'd flash our lights back at them, our spotlights. and. Um, you know, just knowing that uh, something that small brings cheer and joy to a, to a child who's, you know, ill, uh, it, it's a great feeling knowing that, you know, it brings a smile to their face for that small little action that we're doing. It definitely was heartwarming, yeah. I know the, the girl next to me, we both kind of teared up a little bit just thinking, you know, we couldn't see the kids, but we could only imagine their excitement and enthusiasm. we were probably as excited as the kids. Yeah, <laughs> we were little kids with shining our flashlights yeah, and our spotlights.